Yo there guys, what's happening? Welcome back to another video here on Nash Box. Literally, at the time of recording, around about uh, half hour ago at the time of recording, uh, we had an announcement from the Fort Park app. Now, the reason why I'm doing this video is we've got an we've sort of got an, an announcement now of what rides are going to be shut from when the park reopens tomorrow. I just want to say, if you are heading to the parks tomorrow, stay safe, guys. Please social distance if you can. Yeah. Anyway, stay safe tomorrow, guys. Please. Um, but yeah, uh, we've had an announcement on what rides and attractions will be closed. So let's go from. So the first two that they've announced is Darren Brown's Ghost Train, Rise of the Demon, and The Walking Dead, The Ride. Now, we did say that this had been announced earlier in the week. So this isn't new news, but at least we've now got a full-on official confirmation now. Uh, now, the next four are Tidal Wave, Rumba Rapids, Storm Surge, and Death Charge. Tidal Wave, I f I'm a little bit shocked at Tidal Wave. You could social distance on it, I think. Uh, Rumba Rapids, yeah, um, I can see why that's shut. Storm Surge, I'm happy that is shut. I hate that thing. It's good for the view at the top, but apart from that, it's crap. And Death Charge, Death Charge, it's because you've got a queue on the stairs and it's very narrow, I'm not going to lie. Uh, and then the last three attractions they've announced is, the first one is Angry Birds 4D Cinema. This, I'm actually happy they finally announced this. Obviously, when I did uh, a video on Poulton's Park, they had announced that their 4D Cinema was going to be closed. So, uh, at least we know they're going to be shut for a while. No idea how long they're going to be shut for, though. But when they announce they'll reopen, I will let you guys know. And then the final two are... Lumber Jump and Rush. Lumber Jump, I'm not surprised at. You can't really social distance on that thing. It's a little drop tower. Sort of. I'm, I'm sort of on the fence. I'm like, okay, I see why they've done it. But it's, considering that they've got Timber Tugboat open, which is literally right next to it, a bit confusing. And then the one I'm really surprised at is Rush. I quite enjoy Rush. Uh, Rush is a really fun ride. I I always like going on Rush because it, it's just one of them rides, and there's not many SNS uh, screaming sc swings in the UK. I don't think. And I'm going to be totally honest. I I was under the impression you can social distance on Rush because you know you've got see you can do the one meter roll. You can keep people apart on it now. Whether they would, I, I don't know, but. Either way, guys, that is what's going to be closed. So the rides that are going to be closed, I'll go over them again. Uh, Darren Brown's Ghost Train Rides of the Demon, The Walking Dead The Ride, Tidal Wave, Rumba Rapids, Storm Surge, Death Charge, Angry Birds 4D, Lumber Jump, and Rush. But it does sort of shock me why Rush is shut, but Vortex is still allowed to go. That's the end of this video. Uh, leave your comments down below about these announcements from Fort Park Resort. Let me know what you think. I've been Nashi, this has been another video on Nashi Vlogs. I'll see you um, tomorrow for the next video. Peace out.